when I grew up, we did not have a VCR or cable TV. So if there was a good movie that was coming on, we couldn't tape it. And there actually weren't that many good movies that came on that frequently. So when one came on, my mom would call the school and tell them that I was sick. And she and I would stay home and we'd watch it. So I grew up loving movies, much like the heroine of my book, She Went All the Way, Lou Calabrese, who grows up to be a screenwriter. I do love movies so much. So I would like to interpret one of my favorite movies for you, uh, a scene from that movie, if you would allow me to do that. So here we go. What about prom, Blaine? I'm having a bad day. Can we talk later? No. What about prom? Uh, 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 why don't we meet after school? No. What about prom? Come on, Andy. Say it. What? Just say it. Uh, 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 Andy, please. I want to hear you say it. Uh, about a month ago, I, I asked somebody else and I, and I forgot. You're a liar! You're a filthy liar! Why can't you just say it? What? I don't know what you're talking about. You're ashamed of me. You're afraid. You're terrified. Your rich friends won't approve. Just say it. Just tell me the truth. You don't understand. It has nothing to do with you. Andy! <laughs> Any girl who did that to me, I would not be too jazzed to hold on to, Blaine. That girl was, is, and always will be. Nada. Thank you.